All right, everybody, welcome back to the channel and welcome to today's print where we'll be printing the child Grogu or baby Yoda, whatever you want to call him. And how we're going to choose the filament for today comes from one of our subscribers and is a much, much better way to uh, choose the filament than what I showed over um, here, especially if the STL files aren't descriptive. And how we're going to do that is by hitting this assembly view here. And what we can do there is hit the assembly view and then hit this explosion ratio and we can actually explode the parts out. Then you just select the part and select the number just like I showed from doing the things over here and you can just quickly, quickly color your uh, print just by selecting it and then selecting the appropriate color that you would like to have. So that's how I got prepared for um, today's print. And I wanna thank Jared again for um, pointing me in the right direction of um, how to choose the filaments in a much, much better way. I hope this was helpful and I hope you guys enjoy the print. Thank you. All right, and this is the finished product. And man, did he turn out really, really good. There's five colors total. There's bamboo brown. There's Isun olive green, Isun black. Uh, this is Paramount. This is the same color that I printed Groot in. And this is Isun brown right here. In this shot, you can see where the, uh, how easy it was to take off the wham bam plate. That was super easy. He came right off. So did the prime tower and everything. There were no visible marks on there. It looks like glass on the bottom. Uh, he's about 98% perfect. He does have those swirls on the top. So I guess I can mess around with the ironing or whatever to try to take some of that out. But otherwise he turned out fantastic. Hope you guys enjoyed this print. I sure did. He turned out really, really well. I'll see you on the next print.